Are you looking for the best camping tents? In this video we will look at some of the 5 best tents on the market. Before we get started with our video. We have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. The North Face Wawona 6. Are you a camper with a hobby? Then this is your camping tent. The North Face Wawona 6, a long-standing favorite in this review, is the perfect base camp for mountain bikers, rock climbers, anglers, hunters, or anyone packing lots of gear that needs to be protected. Why? The vestibule is like a two-bike garage. The main tent packs an additional 85 square feet, creating a remarkable living space. The Wawona has you covered, and all for a very fair price. All this space does make a few things less straightforward. Setting up the rain fly in garage in the moderate wind isn't as intuitive as it could be. The North Face went with a pin and circle locking mechanism that requires some effort to lock, and because of the height and length of this tent, the guidelines are a requirement unless you enjoy watching your tent sail away into the sunset. That said, once it is up, it is massive, comfortable, and withstood some howling winds and rainy nights in Joshua Tree with ease. With some of the best usable space and an excellent price point, the Wawona has been an award winner year after year with good reason. If weather resistance is a key concern, check out the MSR Habitude. It performs better in wind and rain and scores just behind the Wawona, albeit with a lower space and comfort score. At Number 2. MSR Habitude 4. Are you looking for a spacious and high-quality camping tent but don't want a massive setup? The MSR Habitude 4 is a great choice. This stylish tent is not only light, 12 pounds, and compact, but it's also built with top-of-the-line materials and is both tall, 6 feet 1 inch in the middle, and spacious, 62.4 square feet. On top of that, it features unique touches like a porch light, a large vestibule, and great ventilation. Although there are many positives to the Habitude 4, it isn't perfect. Some flaws include a single door that requires two zippers to open, a light that doesn't come with a battery, and an awkward bag. Those minor things aside, this tent outscored all other four-person tents in our lineup. At Number 3. Nemo Aurora Hi-Rise 6. The Nemo Aurora Hi-Rise 6 is the total package. It packs tons of space and features into a functional, good-looking design. This tent fits a twin mat and two singles with room to spare, and with a max height of 6 feet 5 inches, you can add jumping jacks to your morning indoor camp routine. But the list keeps going. With dual vestibules and an extra-large front door, along with great privacy options and a fun floor design, you will be hard-pressed to find a tent that pairs form and function better. On the flip side, because every coin has two sides, the high-rise is a bit complicated to set up the first time, though it does get easier as you learn. Still, you'll want two people for the job. We don't love the window design on this model, and ideally, there would be more storage pockets. Perhaps Nemo will address some of these things in a future update, but even if they don't, this is a great tent that we don't foresee you being disappointed with. At Number 4. Gazelle T4 Hub. No assembly required sums up the Gazelle T4 Hub. This tent is so easy to pop into place that the average camper could bypass reading the instructions and still have it fully operational in less than two minutes. The T4 Hub is our favorite instant shelter because it's stable, weatherproof, and full of conveniences. The best thing about this shelter is that it's completely self-contained so that you can say goodbye to bundles of bungee-connected aluminum poles, no more assembling, crisscrossing, bending, or clipping. Instead, to set up the T4, plop it on the ground, Pull on each of the four sidewall handles until the wall pops into place, and then lock in the rooftop with a push. We love this tent's removable floor, two large doors, eight massive windows, and seven humongous storage pouches. The drawbacks of this type of structure are weight and size. The rapid setup and solid stability of the T4 hub are made possible by thicker fabrics and an intricate pattern of fiberglass poles. The result is a heavier tent. 31.6 pounds, and a pack size of nearly 6 feet in length. In short, transportation and storage are not this tent's strong suits. It also lacks a vestibule feature, and it's a challenge to stuff it back into its duffel bag. However, if you love this tent's unconventional conveniences and simplicity, you won't mind its slight imperfections. At Number 5. Thule Approach M. 
If you've ever been intrigued by vehicle rooftop tents and think you're ready to take the plunge, check out the Thule Approach M. This softshell tent attaches to the top of your vehicle via a mounting track. Once you get past the initial installation, set up as a breeze, illustrated in our video below. The interior is spacious, with 40 inches of headroom at the highest point, and there are large windows that are lovely for stargazing. The approach locks to your rack, which is a nice feature. We should mention that this style of tent isn't for everyone. You'll need to be prepared to climb up and down a ladder to get in and out of bed, and you'll also need to assess that your vehicle can handle this type of weight on it. If you've taken all this into consideration and you're ready to move forward, the Thule approach is one of our top recommendations. Our only real complaints are that the rainfly is semi-frustrating, it's hard to access all the snaps to attach it, and there is nowhere to store the tent's cover when you remove it, you'll need to stash it in the trunk or truck bed. Overall, we love the approach and think it's one of the best rooftop tents on the market. For a great budget model, check out the Smittybuilt Gen 2 Overlander.